The old track has been, uh, of course it was built 30 years ago and there were several cracks, lots of different problems with maintenance of the track. Um, we had grass growing through it, four to six inch cracks in most places. But that is all about to change. Dr. Damon Eastwood and other track boosters have petitioned the Board of Education along with Superintendent Bargo and the, finally the District's Facility Planning Committee to allocate the $190,000 needed for the track surface. Work began in mid-August to fill cracks, pave the surface, and apply the rubberized top coating. They have also added a pole vault, a long jump, a runway, and a landing pad. All that is needed is for the land lines to be painted. The runners have already begun using the new track surface. Definitely see that it's going to, you know, help with, you know, how, how we feel. We be able to do, you know, more intervals, you know, more 400s, uh, just be out there and, and do more miles. So, um, you know, just on a, on a on a given day, we're just going to be able to feel better from a workout to the next day without running on hard surfaces. It's just going to be a lot easier on your body. It's going to be a lot easier on, you know, just programming in general. For Laker TV, I'm Lucas Reck.